There, Bosley goes not being able to itches the back of his head anymore. Bosley, here. Go. <laughs> you can't reach. You want me to do it for you? <laughs> he could literally only reach the, reach the tip of his ear. Here. Bosley, you want to go see Nora and Steph? Come here. Guys, what's wrong with this generation? Look, this is what's wrong with this generation. Brian, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, <laughs> this isn't even what I was talking. No, I was, just, I was just combing my eyebrows. Okay, first of all, I wasn't—I didn't even know that was going on. I was saying this generation is ruined because Brian asks Nora and Steph to be in one of his videos. They've been getting ready for fucking one hour. No, I, I hate girls. I, you what? Guys, she's nine years old. She's ten. <laughs> How are you guys putting makeup, getting ready for this long? No, really, how old are I'm you guys? I'm done, I've been done. I'm 14. Okay, She's 14, nor how old are you? I'm turning 16. That's not what I asked. Hey, I'm like five Yeah, you eight. asked, what's your age today? You, but yeah, Brian asks for them to be in his video. Oh, I need a shower, and you put makeup on. You know Is this going to be in today's The blow dryer. Doesn't it smell like baby powder? Yeah. Burnt baby powder, huh? Okay, let's go, Brian. Okay, Steph. <laughs> Holy, no, my hair. how many do you need? Really? What video are you guys doing? We don't know yet. Like Not a yet. challenge video of some sort. Is Fuckboy gonna be in it? Or Dare Game or Soda Challenge. Is oh. Fuckboy gonna be in it? Yeah. yeah. Guys, look at this is fat Fuckboy. Fuck Does anyone know where my phone is? Shut, Shut up. up. Yeah, right, wait, hold on. What was your phone? <laughs> hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Speaking of fat Fuckboy, he literally just had breakfast and he comes up with a beef jerky pack and, and vitamin water. <laughs> is Anthony featured in the video? Okay, that's an automatic minus 100,000 views yeah. right there. <laughs> Wait, we're starting it now. Lion! Bosley! Let me. You're gonna cook for us first. Real fat bus. <laughs> Stephanie, Brian's trying to force Steph to make him breakfast. I'm hungry, okay? I'm hungry. <laughs> that's the only reason Steph is here, huh? Yeah. Noor. And I got this. So I heard this. Lovely. Anthony, look. <laughs> Are you zooming into my face? <laughs> she said, Nor. Zoom into my face. <laughs> I'm the, Brian, that's a thumbnail. <laughs> hey, no. Bro. Okay, let me get Steph. Steph, stay right there. Hold on, stay right there. Stay. You're no, it's okay. Everybody let. Okay. I don't want to look at the boots. I want to look at your face. <laughs> The boots are nice. Guys, Stephanie is swagged the fuck out for 14 years old. Oh my gosh. But how basic, the flannel around the waist. Well, when it goes with the necklace and the nice Yeah, but that's sweater. a basic girl. Anthony, nice slipper, nice socks. What the hell are you wearing actually? Oh, guys, look at Anthony's ass. Anthony, look, no, lift up your jacket a little. Oh my God. All my female subscribers wish they were you. <laughs> I swear. I'm almost done editing my vlog of Christmas Day when I was by myself, and then I'm gonna go to the gym. I have to go to the gym. I'm working out my chest and try to. <laughs> Are you guys making the video or no? I want to Shut the fuck up. What, to do. what, you fat ass? <laughs> Anthony. <laughs> Is this your favorite fruit? <laughs> it's Noor's favorite. <laughs> Guys, look. Comment, oh wait, comment wait. below if you don't want Anthony to be in any more of Brandon or Brian's video. You guys oh, heard. You, you funny fuck. Co you guys heard. Comment below. You, were literally look you know the horse riders with the big boots? <laughs> the horse riders? Oh my god. I was so fucking ugly. Well, I still am, but not like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're one to laugh, you I'm ugly. Like this, you oh, I'm just joking, you handsome. <laughs> Guys, it's 2 p.m. The day after Christmas on Saturday. Okay, I need to stop doing that. I need to stop going like this because honestly, there's no point. And I don't know how I got this habit, but I literally do it in every video. I go like this, then I go like this. I don't know. It's just habits. But anyways, I'm off to the gym again. 
not wearing my basketball shoes, so I'm not tempted. But I don't think anybody plays on Saturdays or Sundays anyways. So um, I'm just going to lift and then come back home. I didn't get the invite to the challenge video that Rug and Noor, Steph, and Anthony are doing. But it's okay because I had plans anyways. I'm low-key salty, but still. They went to the store. I think they're buying like some soda. I'm not sure what challenge they're doing. But Rug's video will probably be up before this vlog. So you guys would know it before me. guys you won't believe what just happened so i was at the gym lifting and i was about to uh well first of all say hi to arkan say hi to junior um i was in the gym lifting and these people were playing basketball and they needed one more to run games and i was like no i don't have my shoes sorry like whatever they for they tempted me so bad to play that i left the gym at the end of my workout i'm going all the way home getting my basketball shoes and going back to the gym to play basketball I swear this isn't healthy, but it's my passion. Right, Junior? <laughs> right, Arkan? It's my passion. Arkan's Rockets won last night. They beat the Spurs. By yeah. four points. On my way back to the gym. Guys, I just have to wear double socks. Put my shoes on. God. What am I doing with my life? Hold on, Anthony. Come say hi to my vlog. Guys, my triceps are so sore from working out. It's gonna be a struggle. Oh. What's up, guys? Brass NBA here, and today. He's with Muggs, the Bosley's friend. <laughs> Muggs. I Remember can't what believe this I'm is from? Back. Okay, guys, tie my left shoe, leave my right one untied, because I'm dumb. Guys, the Suns play the 76ers in about two hours. Honestly, if. Oh, let me rephrase. They play the one win, 30 loss. 76ers, the worst start in NBA history. If they lose, holy fuck. I doubt they're going to lose, though. But then again, I've been saying that for weeks about every game. Shit. I just dropped my camera. I'm in such a rush. Okay. Later, guys. Later, hater. So Noor, I said later, you dumb fuck. Bye. It's from Brian's challenge. Ew, pig soda. Raider, look at this one. We drank this. What Seth is that? Thrall. Ran, really? Seth Thrall. Wait, Ron, Ron, Ron Jeremy, Jeremy. <laughs> Ron Jeremy bubblegum soda. <laughs> pig soda. Okay, we made it. I came here pretty fast. Okay, how was the driving? It was terrible. Was it the worst drive he you've ever been? He doesn't give turn signals. He speeds. <laughs> I know. It's not like he's lying. Don't speed. believe him. He's lying. He switches lanes in the middle. Get my ball, please. <laughs> Guys. L O L. <laughs> Honestly, if the Suns lose this game, oh my God. If the Suns lose this game, I'm not watching another game all year. Mark my words, okay? I'm serious. I swear on my life. The Suns lose to the one win, 30 loss, 76ers. Oh my. I'm not watching another game my whole life. Guys, look. Oh, I feel so bad for Jeff Hornacek. This team, oh man. Guys, the Suns have eight. Ooh. The best part about this game so far was Mirza Toledovic. He got a fresh haircut and shaved uh, under his chin. His beard, goatee, whatever it was. That's the best part about this game so far. 19 to 8 Philly. Oh man. Man, man, man. I might be in for a long night. Get it? Night. K N I G H T. Guys, this is the definition of pathetic. Dad, 27 15 Philly. Are you guys playing home? Yeah. Playing home. I already told you, Dad, we lose this game. I'm done this year. Wow, we actually played defense for a possession? Not like we gave up 27 points, not even the end of the first quarter to the worst team in the league. Really quick, so you saw how I took Junior and Arkan to the gym, right? I checked my phone after playing basketball. About 13 missed calls combined from his dad, his mom, my dad, my mom, my cousin, and, I, and about 10 texts. Mirza, I'm done. And about 10 texts saying, where are you, where are you, all this stuff. Okay. 
I guess Junior or Khan did not did not tell anybody that they were going to the gym and Junior's sister called the police to report two missing kids because none of them had their phones with them. And I'm I'm never talking to, to their dad again. I'm scared because I don't get how this is my fault, but of course they're gonna put it on me even though I just went to pick them up. It's their responsibility to tell the dad. Dad, yeah. tell them what happened with Junior. They called the police. Yeah, they think it was uh, like a kidnap or something. See, this is what happens when I take my cousins to the gym, the police get involved. Bosley, did you hear that? Yeah, Bosley. Dad, you're so lucky you're watching this instead of the Suns game. Of course. I know. You're saving yourself stress, a lot of stress. Okay, I'm gonna take a shower at halftime because I feel so sweaty. Guys, I texted Arkan. I said, did Hikmet, who is Junior's dad, as a joke, I said, did Hikmet beat uh, Junior's ass, like, as a joke? And Arkan said he beat mine. He gave me a neck. <laughs> he said, no, I'm just joking. He yelled at us for 20 minutes. I don't know. Like, I saw my phone after playing basketball. I'm just like, why am I so popping right now? 13 missed calls. Like, who was trying to, like, what? And to my surprise, the fucking cops, I don't know. I don't know. I just don't know. But uh, look what I just tweeted. I tweeted, look, LOL, look up fucking joke in the dictionary and this picture will show up. But you can't look up joke. It won't show up for a joke. You have to look up fucking joke. And then that, oh, my dad just told me to stop cussing in my videos. Hold on, let me apologize. Dad, did you hear me? No. Um, on accident, I said the F word. <laughs> because I was talking about the Suns. Yeah, well, cut it off. I know. I, t I told them in the middle. No, I can't because I was talking about the Suns. I can't go on another rant. But I told them. I said, my dad just told me to stop saying bad words, and I accidentally said it. I said it anymore. I know. I won't. Guys, I have to cut down my cussing. I don't even notice it. It just comes out. Bosley, you're so lucky I'm starving. Dad, I swear I was at the gym for like five hours today. Why didn't I bring you food when you were coming home? Cause the Suns game, I was gonna miss it if I brought me food. All, I, I skipped getting me food and I'm starving to death so I can see this. Down by 15. Guys, Bledsoe is down. He's been down for a while and he can't get up. Holy crap. He's had two knee surgeries in his career before. Holy shit, please no. Please, no. Alright guys, so the Suns have kind of woken up. They were down 16 in the first and now up by two with three minutes left in the third. And even if we win this game, which I fully expect us to do now that we've came back. Oh, I haven't heard that before. But uh, no, I expect us to win this game. It's still embarrassing. You're, you're fighting with the worst team Possibly in NBA history. They're for sure the worst team in the NBA today. But possibly the worst team in NBA history. They've won one game and lost 30. And you're struggling to beat them at home. Oh, it's crazy. But uh, yes, um, I don't want to over exaggerate. But Eric Bledsoe got carried to the locker room. He didn't put any weight on his left knee. Which he's already gotten two surgeries on. Okay. And uh, he's not returning to the game today. He's, he's getting an MRI tomorrow morning. So they're going to have information on him tomorrow. Honestly, two years ago, Bledsoe had uh, surgery on the left knee and he missed 41 games that year. And now, I don't know, I'm just hoping it's just like a sprain or maybe just something small. I don't know. But uh, one bright spot is Devin Booker came in for Bledsoe. And what do you expect? He hit two threes in a row and then he got two straight and one. So he's showing up. Youngest player in the league. Much love to Devin Booker. Guys, look. The Pringles dude. <laughs> Mike D'Antoni. Pringles. He coached the Suns for five or six years. He led them to the Western Conference Finals. And one of the years they were 62 and 20. Grinded out battle of this NBA Finals preview. Back and forth game, guys. Just how it's going to be in a seven game series late June. Sun Sixers 2016 NBA Finals. 
This is the game everyone's been waiting for. Ever since the schedule came out, this is the game that's been circled on everyone's calendar. Laugh my fucking ass off. <laughs> Laugh my fucking ass off. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> Guys, wasn't it just 77-75 with about fucking like one minute ago? The Sixers just went on a 12-0 run. They hit four straight th threes in the final minute. I'm literally like, I can't even stop laughing. This is too hilarious right now. Guys, you tell me if I should even watch this fucking fourth quarter. Literally, we were up by one with a minute and a half. Up one with a minute and a half. 90 seconds later. End of the third, we're down by 11. What? That's fucking, oh my God. This team is a joke. This team is pathetic. And this team is embarrassing. That's all I'm going to say. Great. Just great. Another injury. And this time to Devin Booker. Holy crap. Guys. So, you know me, I'm a true Suns fan. I watch every game. I try, I watch every single second, every minute of every game. But honestly, once they went down 17 points in the fourth quarter at home to the 1 and 30 Philadelphia 76ers, a team who has the worst start in NBA history. Without their best player, Jaleel Okafor, I turn my fucking TV off. You, you gotta be pathetic to stay and watch that game. If they win, they win. Nice comeback. If they lose, I don't care. Honestly, good job, Suns. You literally just embarrassed yourself on your home court, and I fully expect them to get booed. I expect them to get booed on their home court. Uh, I texted Jackie, so I'm about to go eat with Jackie. Carne asada fries and chill with my girl. So uh, that'll be better than watching the last six minutes of the game. Man, I'm so done with this season, I swear. I'm so done. Guys, to end my rant, I thought I was done, but I just wanted to add one thing. This is the absolute worst I've ever watched the Suns. It's the hardest time to watch the Suns. And I went through 2013 when the Suns were 25 wins and 57 losses, and their second best player was Louis Scola. And I'm, so me saying this season is worse is saying a lot. Just trust me on that. For whatever reason, I'm re-watching the Suns game right now. You could call me psycho. You could call me crazy. It's 2.05 a.m. 2.05 in the morning. I'm re-watching the fucking Suns game that I don't ever want to talk about. <laughs> oh, man. I'm also reading Phoenix Suns article about the game. I don't know. This, this was just crazy. Like, I couldn't believe... Oh no, I'm done talking about it. Good night, fellas. Like, this was different than being mad at the Suns. This was just like, like, are you fucking kidding me? Can the season just end already? Like, no, I honestly, I don't even want to like, ooh, just know that I don't think I've ever been this like, like had enough of a team. Like, it's one thing to be bad because you're like, you're bad. You don't have good players. That's one thing. It's another thing, like for example, Brooklyn, they're second worst in the East, they don't have good players. It's another thing to have a shitload of talent like the Suns do, Brandon Knight, Eric Bledsoe, Tyson Chandler, and be bad because that means you're playing with no heart, you're playing with no passion, you don't, like, it's just, it, that's worse, I don't know, I'm done guys, I'm fucking done. Guys, you won't believe where I'm at, at... 2.40 a.m. I don't even want to say it, but I'm at McDonald's. Don't judge. I don't know why the hell I'm here, honestly. Why? Literally, why is the truck behind me so loud? And why are his lights so bright? Look at that. What the fuck? Motherfucker, 
charged me 11 cents for ranch. Are you kidding me right now? I forgot McDonald's doesn't make enough money, so they feel the need to charge 11, not even 10 cents, 11 cents for ranch. I said, here's 15 cents, keep the change. You motherfuck. I'm, oh my God. I'm not even gonna enjoy this ranch knowing I paid 11 cents for it. Holy crap, she really said 11 cents. Lawrence, you're missing a good game. Oh man, it's gotta be a joke, right? <laughs> Lawrence, why are you at my house? Honestly, um, again. Because I'm just a little too tired to drive home. How far do you live again? A good hour. Wait, don't show my hair. <laughs> Lawrence, <laughs> someone really made a someone really made a Twitter called Lawrence's hairline, <laughs> and they say ask for waters for advice. Look at my hairline. My hairline's worse than Brandon, Lawrence. I kind of hit your camera now because of my pimples. They I know it's too, too it's too it's HD. Don't even fucking record me anymore. Too bad. Nope. I know I got enough footage, but wait, just tell me who you think is gonna win this game. Oh, uh, I say the Suns. <laughs> you think so? They're yeah, down six with a so. minute. You know? I fucking know. I, love I know. The Suns. This is live. I have, I have fucking it's, faith in the It's Suns. live at 3 a.m. in Phoenix. <laughs> but in Phoenix, it's One 8. One minute left? Yeah. Go on! <laughs> in Phoenix, it's 8 p.m. though. So you can't go to sleep right now? Ooh! No. I know, Devin Booker. I love George Lopez. <laughs> So funny. I've seen every single episode at least once. This is like the only TV show that I actually watch. Aside from NBA.